this. Why didn't he just run away? He's torn up pretty bad. Perhaps he had to fight to protect something. It's all right, little one. I'll help you. You're bleeding heavily. We have to stop it. Chocobo. What happened here? He needs medical attention, and fast. Right. I'll get the doctor. Yeah! Yep! Yeah. Oh. Yo, why doesn't she just cast Kira or something? <sighs> Even worse than I feared. Hey, help me get him to Canopus Farms now. Yes, sir. I won't doctor. let him die. Of that, you have the word of Doctor Gizal. <laughs> Stop okay, moving around go. quickly. Hey, Hope. Do you really think that was a chocobo? Why do you ask? It might be a subspecies, but it certainly looked like a chocobo to me. Right, to me too. But the thing is, when I first saw it, I felt this weird familiarity. You felt familiar with a chocobo? Maybe you just need a friend, Light. Hey, I know what I felt. I'll follow the dock back to Canopus Farms. Alright, looks like we have to run back to the farm. You know, why don't they just take us there? That would have been much better. Considering, uh, you know, we, we could have rode on the thing. But they have to make us run all the way back. You know, they, they, that that is just wrong. That is so wrong. I mean, I guess that's kind of like Final Fantasy thing. Because it... When people... Well when other games make it so that you don't have to run I'm kind of like yeah well you know we should have access to it I guess they should make a make it so we get a decision to either hey go back to the farm or hey kind of walk around and battle and do whatever we want to do Alright, I'm not even sure if I'm running the right way. Definitely not. Alright. We have to head down. Is it down? Yeah, it's all the way down. A straight line, in fact. Let's stop time a bit. Because we don't want to waste too much time. And the fact I like it in the uh, afternoon. I'm sorry. Dr. Gazal's in surgery right now and can't be disturbed. You'll have to wait here. Give me some fresh water. As I stood there, watching the doctor try to save the chocobo's life, I knew this was no ordinary animal. Not only because of the legend, I felt a connection, as if we'd fought together. But why? It made no sense. See for yourself. Oh, 
All right, let's check out who this is. Dr. Gazal has it's probably, maybe it's Saz, or Saz is Chocobo. Yeah, maybe it is, who knows. There. Is he all right? His wounds are cleaned and dressed, but he's still dying. Can't you help? Listen to me, he's half starved. If he is to recover, he needs nutrients, vitamins, protein. But no matter what we do, we can't make him eat. Is he that weak? It's not a question of being weak. He's too proud. That's the problem. We've tried everything to coax him, but he simply won't accept any food from humans. And the fool beast just glares at us. That pride will kill him. Such a stubborn bird can be none other than the Angel of Valhalla. The only human the Angel will bow to is the one he recognizes as Master. Perhaps he will obey you. Try it. Offer him this. Light. It might be the Chocobo's only hope. Try giving him that vegetable. Is this all right? Well, it looks like he recognizes you as his master. As long as we keep providing him with feed, he should recover. I say we, but of course I mean you. He will not accept help from anyone else. He has to be your responsibility and yours alone. If I do it, will he recover? I would bet my reputation on it. This is the bird of legend. You're destined to ride him to the fountainhead of the chaos. But before you can do that, the bird needs to be fed. So you said. Any hints? What kind of food should I give him? I prescribe a balanced diet of Gizal greens, quality sheep's milk, and nutritional supplements. Ask the villagers if they have any greens or milk to spare. Hmm, you don't look well. But he needs more treatment before he's fully recovered. So now I have to play nurse to a giant bird. I'm telling you, it better be worth the trouble. Hey, hey, don't... Sorry, I... It's all right. No harm done. I was only warning you. I've just planted a whole crop of gazelle seedlings. Right. Chocobo's favorite food. Yep, and our bread and butter. This is our... F you should feed that white... Normally we... He'll become your steed. I heard that the white-winged herald has appeared in these lands. If that Chocobo... He'll be able to guide you to the temple of the goddess, and the... Oh, you should eat. <laughs> A bunch of fuss buckets, aren't they? The villagers, I mean... Everyone's... Well, you have to be. Just remember, if someone scratches your back... Alright, so we're gonna look for more food? I was never one for keeping pets. Somehow, that doesn't surprise me. So, what are you going to do next? Next job. Welcome, traveler. Care to rest? I wonder who has more food. Fresh bed. I'm certainly not going to eat potion. Don't you worry. Everyone see something. Hey, there's vegetable seeds. Ooh. Maybe we should just buy some. Oh, thanks a lot. They're only seeds after all. You could knock me down. Get one over. No, don't get me wrong. It's just that 100. And I came along. Yeah, but look, everyone in this village, I'm pretty much in charge. All right, we're going to continue to stop time. My friend. Yes, he's safe for now. Lucky for us both. All right, we got something. Let's try to feed him it. Impressive. Drink this. Mm. 
It's a unique specimen, without a doubt. But it needs to eat what other chocobos eat. Even a legend can't live on air and admiration. Did you try offering him food again? Yes, we've tried. I guess I... Hello. Have you taken the time? The villagers? Oh, right. And now he's your... Answer their... Pr no, it is true. He's a founder of the village. But um, the fact is, we've all got our... A man who want... A man who still... Folk who suffer... Garrett's taken it on himself to look after everyone, but... He seemed cheerful enough. He's the last survivor of the intrepid... To him, we're all... It's not an easy road, he's... But why am I... You've done plenty? I reckon... But even if nothing is really... Alright, that is just taking a long time. Let's see if we can talk to him. Hmm, you don't... Yeah, he's still healing nicely, but... We need to talk to someone. This guy. Hey. We grow gazelle. There's a man and his daughter who have their own field. Cole and Sarala are their names. Maybe they have some to share. I haven't seen Cole in a while. He often wanders out of the village on Alright, and where is his village then? Maybe it's up there. No, wait, we just came from there. How are things? We grow gazelle. There's a man in his... She tries to hide it. Once he's back to full health, it's his destiny. As the one... Would you like something? We offer good old-fashioned country hospitality. Hello there. You know, there's so much food here. Why can't they just feed the chocobo that? Welcome, traveler. We offer good old fashioned Everything is fresh off the, the greens I pick up. Thank you. How does it look? Can you well, the doctor said. Why, that is good news. I could give you lots normally, but we've just shipped off our latest. So it's no use. Actually, gazelle greens ripen ever so fast. They spring out of. Father. But the woods aren't that far. Could something. He does it all the time. He wanders off without a word. That's why I'm. The least he could do is. It's not right. Oh, and you have no idea. His name's Cole. If you happen to see Father. Alright, try, try time to save his father so we can get on with this quest. Father headed towards. So there he he headed off into a hunting woods. Alright, the station. Grassland. Ooh. I don't I think the wood is that way. I think the wood is this way. Ah, oh, boy. Father is always wandering. Well, let's go into a quest and just take a look at that. All right. Yeah, that that is the way. So. Uh, that's really far away. Oh well. Guess we're gonna have to run there. <laughs> 